Welcome to F123's official deep dive part one with a focus on new gameplay features, handling improvements, new circuits and more. F123 delivers a universal leap forward in gameplay with innovation to the vehicle physics engine for improvements to handling, low speed traction and overall drivability. As a result, you'll feel more predictable and authentic vehicle behaviour on track in three key areas – acceleration, braking and rotation. To achieve this, the development team first updated the physics calculations for the slip of tyres and how this interacts with the inertia of the car itself. Real F1 team feedback has been incorporated into F123 gameplay. You know, when, when the guys at Codemasters and the team came approaching me to say, look, we've tweaked the new game, give it a go, see what you feel, things you like, things you don't like, felt like there's been quite a big change with it. The balance between aerodynamic grip from the cars and mechanical grip from the tyres was fine-tuned to get it much closer to real life, in turn enhancing the authenticity of every drive. The way the engine delivers torque has been refined, making it more progressive relative to your gear and throttle input, which enriches all of these other changes to make throttle response more realistic. The underfloor of the cars was also improved to make interactions with curbs and rumble strips more true to life. You'll really feel all of this new handling detail through a force feedback steering wheel, but controller drivers listen up. Introducing precision drive controller technology in F123, a transformative controller input tech to enable a more precise and rewarding driver experience on standard controllers. Whether your driving style is smooth or aggressive, Precision Drive will elevate confidence for controller players, especially during those intense wheel-to-wheel -wheel racing moments that make F1 so thrilling. Real F1 race distances range anywhere from about 44 laps to 78, give or take, depending on the circuit. When you're playing a video game, you might not want to commit to a full Grand Prix, even though it'd be the most realistic experience. To alleviate this, F123's new 35% race distance option creates an ideal balance that enables you to use a realistic race setup and strategy where tyre wear is still crucial, but you're not having to commit to race a full-length Grand Prix. 35% race distance was first pioneered for F1 Esports to give a balance of strategy and excitement. With this new setting, you can specify how you want your race weekend to play out, and races will be more accessible from a time commitment standpoint. Building on the existing safety car feature, red flags are now in the game in F123. The system now monitors track conditions and determines whether to trigger a virtual safety car, a full safety car, or a red flag. The sensitivity of red flags can be adjusted, similar to the safety car feature. A variety of things can trigger a red flag like debris on track, cars stopping on track, extreme wet conditions and more. AI cars can initiate red flags as a result of racing incidents, but they're more likely during a multiplayer event when users are racing wheel to wheel. The new red flag feature also adds a new strategy element to race day. Under a red flag, you're allowed to adjust your race strategy, fit new tyres and repair some damage, just like in real F1 races. Two brand new circuits arrive in F1 23, Las Vegas and LaSalle. The highly anticipated Las Vegas circuit has been built from the ground up in F1 23 and the game will be the first chance for fans and F1 drivers themselves to experience the track ahead of the race. In-game, the track will be as accurate as possible. It was designed from thousands of reference photos from around Las Vegas. A huge amount of photogrammetry data was acquired from the Vegas Strip for ultimate authenticity. For the sale, official FOM computer-aided design combined with ArcGIS World Atlas aerial imagery, height data and photogrammetry of the circuit were integrated to create the most accurate representation of the new track. And when F123 launches, you'll be able to race at some additional fan-favourite circuits like Portimao, Paul Ricard and Shanghai. 
F-123 was built to give you more control on track and to provide a more realistic feeling drive every time you play. Tune in to part two of the F-123 Deep Dive series on the 19th of May.